It is now 12 after 8. The spotlight this weekend is on mushers and sled dogs because the Iditarod starts on Saturday. We wanted to give some insight into the sport, so multimedia journalist Luke Simmons went to Gilpin County north of Blackhawk and he captured a musher and his five dogs ready for a run. Hang on, Sadie. Hang on, buddy. Easy, Rain Rain. These, these are Siberians. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. We're going to go soon. They love to run. Soon. Um, and they need the exercise. And so as you can see, Rainy, she wants to go. So she's, if she doesn't get to run, she, she does this. They're confused. They want to go. There's not enough snow on the ground. We run on ATVs. Basically, it's just, uh, they hook them up to the front of the ATV. They pull the ATV. Um, I have to put on a little bit of gas, help them out. But uh, it's basically it's a, it's a controlled, safe way of running. Let's go, bub. So all these guys, they're, they're completely used to being harnessed. They know the routine. Most of them know which paw they've got to lift. He's a good boy. They've got a, they've all got a nice, uh, a nice underlayer. It's, it's like it's snowing all year round with these guys. Yeah, mushing, that's, that's the technical term for it, yep. And it comes from the, uh, the French word, mâché, to, to hike or to walk. It's, it's a team, whole team sort of exercise. Everybody has, a, has their own roles and responsibilities within that team. Uh, the, the lead dogs, they, you know, they have to listen to commands, they have to make certain decisions. The guys in the back, they do a lot of the weight and the pulling. And it's my job to also run with them and to, to make sure that we're going in the right direction. So happy. I know that was last Saturday before it snowed over the weekend. <laughs> so I'm sure they're much happier now. Will, by the way, is a member of the Colorado Mountain Mushers. He's originally from Australia, you could tell. But he got into the sport five years ago when he moved here to Colorado. While Will's dogs are Siberians, most of the dogs in the Iditarod are Alaskan. Huskies and Dr. Randa McMillan is here right now, but you are a vet yes. who in the past has